ITV4 Weather. Aloha Hawaii. Welcome back. It was a beautiful day to be outside. One of our you local users went uh, ATVing. I think that's what you call it, right, Kenny Choi? Yeah. ATVing. Still have yet to do that. But this was the view out there in Ka'ava Valley. Gorgeous. We thank DL for snapping that for us. Taking a look at Pinpoint Doppler tonight. We're not seeing much in the way of rain. Just those sprinkles coming through. A lot of it right over the Ko'olau Mountain Range. East Maui damp tonight. More of those pockets of showers pushing in out of the east-northeast. So that's going to ride in with the trades. But expect heavier showers later this evening over many of our Windward and Malka sections. And as I told you, that's going to keep us pretty damp into Aloha Friday. Again, here's an update. Anywhere you see coloring across the state is where we are dealing with drought conditions, especially dry right through central Molokai, up into the leeward side of Haleakala, and even into north and south Kohala. Well, we told you about the possibility of VOG moving into the forecast. That possibility popping up this coming Friday. Here's what's happening. High pressure, our trade wind maker, off to the northeast of the state. It is pushing away from the islands. That movement there will lighten up the winds and cause those directions to shift in out of the muggy southeast. So again, if you are sensitive, start preparing now. You know, get those outdoor workouts through because by Friday, Saturday, again, it's not going to be very pretty for you. Stay indoors if at all possible. You want to drink a lot of those warm fluids, so get that uh, miso soup or hot tea ready. Again, those temperatures and cool winds today help to keep things comfortable. It didn't uh, hurt that we had clouds outside. Right now, it is 78 degrees in Lihue, 73 Lana'i City, and 80 in Kailua Kona. Well, we've got Flat Central tomorrow in the surf department, North Shore, West Shore, into town as well. Still breezy and pretty rough and choppy for our east-facing shores. That's really the only spot you're going to see some surf out there. Taking a look at our extended forecast again, there's the rain Thursday into Friday. Then we turn muggy and voggy. Ooh really rough weekend ahead of us. By Sunday, the light trade should start to fill in, and then we get back to those typical trade wind weather conditions.